And it's usually easy peasy. Welcome there. So, this is a little bit more manageable. Yeah, we do have a lot of Vault Hunt here. A lot of Vault Hunt. But I still want to draw into relevant cards. Yeah, that's not helping me too much. Fine. We can start with Imralet, boost him up. That's just a statement, right here. What now, Hector? He's going with the alternative skin, because it looks like, uh, well... I just try not to hurt his feelings. It doesn't look as good as the other one. I have no boost to really try to save Imralet. can play out the riders, which is enough. I asked this Vikri to graveyard hit, but it's better against big boys. Rip in peace, Drowner. It's punishing me again. With my choice of not liking Drowner. Yeah, let's just go with the Archispor. Yeah, the Drowner needs to go down. <clears throat> Come on, don't get me started with the Drowners. Oh, Drowners suck. We don't like them. Ooh. So I can take out a Rider. Uh, maybe we're just gonna do that. There is no escape. Did the music stop? For this shit. I don't get the bitches. A lot of guys already stopped using the witchers, but some are some players are really, really on board with them. That's actually really good for me. Thanks for that. I don't think we're gonna get a better deal than that. So I'm taking it. <clears throat> I chucked. I won a game of Gwent with Arrakis Queen. What? Uh, what? <clears throat> no, I chuckled. I won a game uh, of Gwent with Arrakis Queen. Ask me anything, Gwent. Wow. Uh, I've never seen anyone play that. <laughs> I need video evidence or, or it didn't happen. Wow, really? Vercat? I'm a little bit conflicted about Neutral. I don't like him that much. Oh, really? Wow. Uh, we gotta keep playing here. And this is just okay? It's not great. Well, it seems like it's unlikely that we're gonna win. But it's wow. We're, we're screwed. How did we lose so hard? Because he had witchers, and overall, our hand was still not amazing. I can't play Nitra. We are screwed. And that's a pass. You, went, you have to win three games with her for a faction challenge? Mm. 
Seems like the community is given up. No one is playing her. What? He's gonna play something? Do it! Hector, do it! Why? Time I taught you some respect! Alright, Hector. You wanna party? What's up with these guys who push me around too with a long run strategy? Oh, he's probably the Mortar guy, right? Now this this is where it really comes into play that you're playing your own strategy, but are you really considering the strategy of your opponent? Because I would argue not so much. You're pushing big monsters with your Mortar. Let's slam or, sp or spear tip down. And yeah, losing a card in the process. Well, I'm not really losing a card, but he had a card advantage. Sure thing. He went from most likely gonna win to most likely going to lose. Gotta hide cards. <clears throat> so it seems like there is nothing big we can eat in the hand. And this is the biggest one. Well, I mean, this is the biggest one. Nagulfar can find Osrael. But if he. Well, yeah, this is how we gotta play it. So this eats that. Nagul find. Nagulfar. Oh, fuck. I want to open the deck, but also look at uh, the cards I'm drawing. Yeah, we're gonna go with that. Yeah, this is how we're gonna play it. So we have three cards in the deck that's worth eating. Should I start by eating the biggest one? That way he's never gonna play it. That ship went too far. It didn't come back, Hector. He doesn't even care. He's used to life giving him a... Uh, <coughs> These punches. God damn it. Just playing the big dudes on the board. Just playing neutral. Why not? Yeah, might as well buff that. I hope he doesn't have a. Uh, fuck me. What is that garbage? Uh, Gerald reset everything or whatever he is. <gasps> no way! Yes, Mordzart! This is the problem with this strategy. Well, compared to mine. He has one unit that's gonna eat like... 18 points, so it's gonna be a 22. But of course he gave, he gave it plus 3. 
but that's not that good. And versus, this is garbage, but everything else is just uh, basically what I'm doing. What? Okay. The pass did work. Sorry, guys. Yeah, you can't get away with one finisher, dude. That's not good enough. You need three finishers, or four, or five. Hector, you need to get with the program. This is just pathetic. But GG anyway. So we're just getting rid of the goals. This is so bad. This is the worst you can have. Basically. Because we have all the goals. We don't want any of them. We have two riders. And we have complete trash. So if we somehow didn't lose this game. And also we have only have two mulligans. Only two mulligans instead of three, which we would get if we went first. Plus, we don't have our weapon counter, which is in the deck. Plus, our ship is in the deck as well to find the weapon counter. And we can play the Knackers. Guys, I think we're gonna lose. This is just uh, ridiculously unlucky. So, we have two choices. Either not play the Knacker... Or play the Necker anyway. But he might just kill it. Because he likes to play those X-Men that kill everything. I don't know. I think we are screwed. I don't think we're gonna win this. This basically never happens. But... When it does... What do you do? Also, I generally like to play first. And now, the plus 5 point uh, could be quite relevant. So, yep. <clears throat> Uncrate Marauder. I don't intend to complain, but no mood to talk. RNG really hates us. I just want a fair fight game. What the hell? So... Uh, let's just play the Archispor. If we ever gonna play it, it's gonna be right now. I'm not sure how... How far we can push with the kind of garbage we have. Don't you pester me. He even has the Witchers. Which are really bad. But I suppose they are okay tempo. I'm a little bit surprised that he's hitting all my dudes. Instead of trying to kill something. Yeah, now he has the highest unit. Uh, might as well throw down the Necker Warrior. No RNG in Gwent. Yeah. The old Gwent. Uh, yeah. Not much RNG in that. You Gwent? Well, you could just have your starting hand and press forfeit. I suppose the one plus we have is that we're going second, and he really wants to win it. So even if we play lackluster cards, he just isn't gonna stay with us. We need to have the highest unit on the board. But this is garbage. I shan't let you down. So if I play this, we're gonna be at 26, actually 27, then I can take the round. Uh. 
Well, I can't take the round because he's gonna keep playing. But I'm gonna play these two. Can he kill it? And with what? What we're trying to prevent here is some round free cheesy strategy that uh, he most certainly has. If he could force out that strategy round two and just try to drop down big dudes round three, that would be preferable. By the way, what do you guys think? Are you guys happy with how many cards you draw round two and three? Or would you prefer to get more or less? Because old Gwent... Holy crap! He passed? <gasps> what are you doing, man? So, we can play this for five. Oh, or we can play this for... Well, this is basically garbage, but we can play this for six. This is actually better... Uh, to play it right now. Death comes for you. Why did you pass? Are you crazy? Maybe he had all his combo pieces. I maybe he's just thinking like, up oh, gold card, gold card, gold card. I don't know which one to play. They all were like twenty points. I should just say million bucks. Uh, well, I'm just gonna pass. And pass again. Maybe I'm just not gonna push him round two. But yeah, I will. <laughs> but he doesn't know that. Apparently. What is that? Um... Not that. Now go far. Now we're talking. Yeah, I don't know. That's garbage. Maybe we're gonna keep the Osrel. Fucking hell, we got back our goal. So... I'm a little bit concerned about his hero power. And we can get... Well, if we get Vivas Incantation, that's not good. Neutral. I don't know. It's not necessarily good. So we can go with Necker Warrior. He's definitely not gonna hero power that. But he might just X-Men it. I'm gonna call it X-Men because... Who wants to call it Uncrate Marauder? I can call it Marauder, but is it the only Marauder in the game? Maybe. I'm not sure. Oh, I don't mind that that much. Okay, let's go with that. The Arcus Poor is really weak. Can he kill it? And how would he kill it? He has at least one way to blow it up. Okay, two ways, if you count his hero power. But he probably doesn't want to play that. It's darkness. Wait, what? We shall do it my way. It's not darkness, it's dark fortress. Oh. The four is kind of ruining it. I could get on board with dark fortress, but it's dark fortress. No, I, sorry, I can't do that. Probably have to eat one of them. Can't Coldwell. 
Now this is tricky. I think we have to play old spear tip here. And not sure what we're doing. Eat savage bear in your graveyard, so we're not doing that. Yeah, we have to eat this in the graveyard. Possibly with the goal. And we are getting away from this round after that. Oh, really? That was incredibly weak. So do we pass? He needs to play something for five, at least. Um, of course, he can spear something as well. So it's gotta be a, a pretty good round uh, three. And we're gonna have two finishers. Uh, with a cold well, maybe even a Vivas incantation that goes well goes with a cold well. I don't know. Not sure if I want to push him here. If he blows this up by accident, then he's gonna need even more points. So he needs to be somewhat careful. Yeah, it needs five points. Obviously that would have not worked for last round. Beavis Incantation, give me that. Wow, this is really good. Does he have another weapon? It actually doesn't really matter because... Uh, you really shouldn't keep it. It's bad. A goal would be good. If we could have that. That would be the nuts hand. That's not nuts. That's not that hey, bad. Listen here. Listen well. <clears throat> Did he discard something? relevant for me. No, he discarded the other weapon. Maybe not now. We have sync temptation. Should I do it right now? Yeah, we might get a unit that needs to drive like a necker. We want to play that early. Alright, I'm not sure if I'm optimistic about this. He only has one card. So I do have last say. Not sure what he's thinking about. What the hell, Dark Fortress? I'm not too familiar with the names, but 
I have a very strong suspicion what he's gonna do. Wolf head in, yeah, half a unit. That's expected. We know the mysteries of time and space, all of them. Dagur two blades, followed by the hit everybody. You can play the guy in the back, just in case. Just ho hoping that he's gonna take some hits. Um. Creating cold cold there. And of course our last move is the strongest. It's gonna be Won't pay us in gold. It's really big. Pay us in blood. Well we got this. I'm not too concerned about this uh, Skellige deck. It's usually very uh, manageable. Also very straightforward. <laughs> I can't really critique a deck uh, based on that, because my deck is uh, very straightforward. And I kind of like it that way. Anyway, GG, X-Men guy. Or whatever I should call you.